for Age of Empires 2. Today we are going into the Saladin campaign, Chapter 1, An Arabian Night. Egypt. A month since I entered the Holy Land. I was in a foreign land, and I was dying. I wandered the cold desert for four nights before the horse archers found me. I had abandoned my mount to the vultures and my armor to the heat of the day. As a knight, I was not much of a threat to them. I thought these men were Turks, come to toy with their prey. But when I could distinguish the riders from the blood of Mirage, I saw that they were Saracens, the rulers of the Middle East. I had ridden to the Holy Land with the Crusaders from France and Normandy, so I was by all rights these Saracens' enemy. Yet they gave me water and a spindly horse, and led me back to their leader. And that was how I met Saladin. The paintings in Europe show Saladin as demonic, barbarian. Yet he is more chivalrous than any knight I'd met before, and prefers the palaces of Damascus to slaughtering Normans in the desert. I had not expected hospitality from Saracens. We Normans execute any armed Arab we capture. But Saladin left me free to explore his camp. Perhaps he wants an objective observer to chronicle the prodigious bloodshed ahead. Saladin's army is heading south to Egypt to reinforce Cairo. Egypt is a tempting prize for the Crusaders. She is fabulously wealthy, yet governed by an ineffectual fool. Before my capture, I was en route to join in the Crusaders' assault on Egypt. It is a bitter irony that now I shall view the contest from the enemy camp. So it was that I found myself less than a hundred miles from the Dead Sea in the company of my enemies. All right, guys, here we go. We got to defeat the Franks west of Cairo. What's Super that? guys up here. This level's pretty easy up until the very last minute or so. Um, it's, it's a little bit trickier then. I'm not going to kill my honors. My, uh, the Holy scorpions. Land is ours now, and soon Egypt will be as well. Down you go. I really don't like scorpions all that much. Oh, I don't find them all that useful. We're just gonna make our way down this way. Also, what I'm gonna do is change these guys to neutral. So that way we don't have to mess with their buildings. Nice little trick. Saladin, where are you going with that great army? Get him! Get up in the fray. Down you go. Bad. Moving right along. Foot soldiers first. Don't even worry about him. Really just worried about blue right now. Got some more blue to deal with down here. And ever so slowly. Careful. Ah, oh, we triggered him. Lovely. All right, get in there. You did it. So you get to it. Get him! I don't know. Oh, my siege weapon's done. Damn it! The scorpions never last long. I really don't care for the scorpions at all. Damn you. Saladin, I am afraid that I do not trust your motives. Turn back at once! I'm gonna split these guys up a little bit. Spread them out. I have allied myself with the Franks. We will conspire to keep you out of Cairo. 
The sucks. Saladin, the Egyptians are cowardly and weak. If we station troops near their main mosque, they will surely surrender. So we're gonna need to Lord knock out some Saladin, we have captured the Frankish war vessel. You will not enter Cairo. Yes, I will. Just wait and see. I need to try to knock out these archers. There's really, like, no one in Cairo, so... Not much I need to worry about there. Backing up. Well, just have to kill this guy. There we go. Keep hitting that gate. Alright guys, I'm gonna wait for this gate to get knocked down ever so slowly, and I'll be right back. Alright guys, got the gate down. Now I'm just gonna start making my way up through here. As quickly as we can. Sprint through the town here. Uh, you gotta take care because there's actually a castle over this way, so I'd recommend moving up the western side of the town. Here, pretty soon, we'll be out of this mess. So we're just trying to make our way up here. And then, uh, the Saracens will surrender. They're a bunch of pussies. Kill that priest. Kill that friggin' priest. Get in there. Saladin. Yes. The Franks have betrayed us. They mean to invade Cairo. We were wrong not to trust our fellow Saracens. Please, Stuff. these troops are yours to command. Just defeat the treacherous Franks. Alright, so now they're on our side. Again. Sided with the Franks. Luckily, I'm nice. I'm a nice guy. So I'll help you out. So, got a nice size army here. The scorpion's pretty much dead, so I'm not even really worried about it. Alright, so let's make our way up. I'm going to use a couple of scouts, uh, because I don't want to just run straight up in here, because they do have some uh, onagers, and those onagers will ruin my force if I'm not careful. So I'm actually going to grab a save here. For some people this part is very easy, but I've actually had a little bit of trouble with it at times. Alright, so let's send our, actually, let's send a nice little group at a time here. Let's move these guys up. Just get everyone outside. Start moving them all a little bit closer. I'm really thinking they must have uh, beefed up the characters here in this last part, because it's actually kind of tough. Um, I'm guessing they beefed it up for the HD collection. I'm not 100% sure on that. Seems like there's more guys here than I remember there being. I'm gonna send a little squad in. Try to knock out that onager. There's actually two onagers. We need to drop them both. If we want to survive. Up in there, come on. Drop it, drop it, drop it. Kill it, kill it, kill it! Yes! The other one. I know you can kill it. I know you can kill it. Damn it! That monk is really giving me a run for my money. Nice little squad going. Let me get rid of that monk, too. Because he's a pain. They really must have beefed this up, though, because... I just really don't remember there being this many guys. Alright, did I kill the monk? I think I did. Get that onager. Come on, man. Come on. Get the onager. Fuck. Alright. Another little group. The rest of it shouldn't be that hard. Once I get rid of these uh, onagers. I think 
Yeah, I see the onagers, so we're gonna sneak our way around here. We're not in there. I'm just gonna move around the side. I wonder if I can lure them towards that castle. Well, I guess they're also allied with the Franks, so that wouldn't really work. Go for the Onager. Go for it. Destroy him. Now, Pearl! <laughs> Come on, guys. Run back to my army. Maybe I can lure some of them. That's probably what I should do. Yeah, that's what's gonna happen here. We're gonna lure some of them back. I just don't remember there being a monk or two onagers there. I remember there being one onager and no monks. That makes it a lot harder. Kill him! Commence the slaughter. Perfect. Now we can just lure a few at a time. Get these guys back. Why are these guys not on my number two anymore? Kill the pikemen. Kill those pikemen. Those pikemen must go. First. Come on, hit him. Bye, pikemen. Yeah, but it's a good idea to try to eliminate Franks as much as possible. Now let's start moving our guys in. The pikemen. Back, move back. I think they're almost destroyed. A little bit of maneuvering and luring did the trick. I think that was it. Sweet. A bit more of a pain than I remember. Knock it down! Out of the way so our siege unit can get in there. There we go. Perfect. And this will conclude the first salad in level. The Franks have been defeated. Awesome. Right. The Franks are dispersed and the Egyptian army broken. Saladin has taken his place as governor of the Nile. Any European king would seize this opportunity to eliminate his political enemies. Saladin, however, allowed any Egyptian opposed to his rule to leave the city unharmed. Saladin has set out to win over the population. In Cairo, he built mosques and palaces, universities and hospitals. My own countrymen, the sons of Europe, showed naught but treachery, while the Saracens worked to dignify their civilization. It is a troubling turn of events, and I have difficulty sleeping. Hi, hey guys. Here's my final stats. I hope you enjoyed that. In the next episode, we'll be doing Lord of Arabia. See you then.